Hello everyone. My name is Cikgu Nabila. Welcome to my class Mathematics Form 1 KSSM. Okay, for today I want to show you how to do basic arithmetic operation of integers. Okay, this is in chapter 1, KSSM. Okay, the previous lesson you have learned is integers are positive and negative numbers including 0. So, how to add and subtract integers? Okay, this is the tips for you. If you want to add same sign, so you add the number, retain the sign. Okay, so we look at the example first. 7 plus 9 so 7 is positive so we look at the sign positive both positive so same sign so we add the number 7 plus 9 equal to 16 okay another example negative 7 minus 9 okay negative 7 minus 9 we look at the sign negative negative same sign so even this one negative do not minus the number because the tips given if same sign you plus the number Okay, you plus the number 7 plus 9 equal to 16. Okay, the problem is, is it this positive or negative? So, retain the sign mean that you look at the question negative, both negative, right? So, you retain this sign, your answer also should be negative 16. Okay, next, number 3, negative 20 minus 8. So, for this case also same, look at the sign, both negative. Okay, both negative, so we plus the number Okay, so we plus the number 20 plus 8 equal to 28. Is it positive or negative? Look at the sign. Both negative. So your answer also retain the sign negative number. So negative 28. So you can try to do this in your exercise book. Okay, number 1. Negative 4 minus 5. So look at the sign. Same sign. We plus the number. So, 4 plus 5 equal to 9. Okay, so retain the sign, negative 9. So, your answer is negative 9. Number 2, negative 10 minus 7. Okay, negative 10 minus 7, same sign, negative, negative. So, we plus the number. 10 plus 7 equal to 17. Then, retain the sign is negative 17. Negative 6 minus 14. Okay, look at the sign. Same sign, so plus the number 6 plus 14 equal to 20. Do not confuse with the sign negative in front of the number. You just look at the symbol first. The sign is same, so you plus the number 6 plus 14 equal to 20. And then we retain the sign negative, so negative 20. Okay, next. How to add, subtract an integer if given different sign? Okay, if given different sign, so you have to subtract the number. Just now, is same sign, you plus. If different sign, you minus. Okay, subtract the number, choose the sign of the bigger number. Okay, this is the example given. 10, uh, 4 minus 10. Okay, 4 minus 10. 4, no number in front of number 4, no sign in front of 4, so we consider this one as plus. So, look at the sign, different sign, 1 plus, 1 minus, different sign. Okay, so if different sign, we have to subtract the number, minus, the bigger minus smaller. So, 10 minus 4 equal to 6. Now, is it 6, the answer positive or negative? So, you look at the question, which number is bigger, is it 4 or 10? So, for this case, 10 is bigger. Okay, 10 is bigger. So, we take the sign in front of 10 is negative. In front of 10, the bigger number is negative. So, your answer also negative. Okay, look at this example. Negative 5 plus 9. So, look at the sign. Different sign. If different, minus the number. So, 9 minus 5 equal to 4. Is it positive or negative 4? So, you look at the sign. Which one is bigger? 9 is bigger. So, the sign of 9 is positive, right? So, the answer also positive. 
but usually we do not write the positive number uh, at the end of the answer so you just write down four only okay number three look at this look at the sign different sign negative positive different sign minus the number okay so we minus five minus three equal to two five minus three do not confuse with the symbol in front of the number five minus three equal to two Positive or negative, you look at the number bigger, 5 if it's bigger. So the sign for 5 is plus. So you write down the answer is plus 2. Okay, next. Plus 7 minus 12. So same, look at the sign, different sign. So we minus the number 12 minus 7 equal to 5. Is it positive 5 or negative 5? Look at which number is bigger. 12 is bigger. So the sign for 12 is negative so your answer also negative. Okay, so you can do this in your exercise book. Okay, we'll discuss together negative 4 plus 5, negative 4 plus 5, different sign minus the number. 5 minus 4 equal to 1. Positive, negative, which one is bigger? Positive, so positive 1. Okay, we do not write the positive number. Positive sign, sorry. We do not write the positive sign in front of the number at the end of the answer. Okay, number 2, negative 10 plus 7. So, different sign minus number. 10 minus 7 equal to 3. Positive or negative? Which one is bigger? Negative is bigger. So, negative 3. 6 minus 14. Different sign. 6 is plus. 6 uh, is positive. So, different sign minus the number. 14 minus 6. Positive, negative. Negative because 14 is bigger. So negative 8. 15 minus 35. Different sign. Minus the number. 35 minus 15 equal to 20. Positive, negative. Negative because the 35 is bigger. So negative 20. Okay. Next we go to if given bracket. For example like this. 5 minus negative 2. Okay, so tips for bracket and also can be applied at multiply. So if same sign, same sign, positive, positive or negative, negative, you change to plus. If different sign, you change to minus. Okay, you look at the question. 5 minus minus 2. Minus minus 2. Dif uh, same sign. So same sign, we change this one into plus. Okay, change this one into plus. Same sign, change to plus. So it will become like this. 5 plus 2. Both sign just now already eliminate. You change into the new sign, positive or plus. Okay, so two, uh, 5 plus 2 equal to 7. Question number 2, 8 plus negative 6. So plus negative, different sign, change into minus. Okay, change into minus. So, it will become like this. 8 minus 6. Okay, 8 minus 6 then equal to 2. Okay, 20 plus minus 7. So, plus minus 7. So, same different sign change into minus. Okay, change into minus. So, it will become 20 minus 7. So, 20 minus 7 equal to 13. Okay, number 4. Negative 10 minus plus 12. You solve bracket first, plus minus, okay, plus minus, it will become minus, different sign. So, it will write down like this, negative 10 minus 12. Okay, so how to solve this? You have learned just now, same sign plus the number, retain the sign, so it become negative 22. Okay, steps to solve basic arithmetic operation. Okay, we follow, uh, we follow Bob Maslow. Okay, this is the Bob Maslow. Bob Maslow said, if in the question contain bracket B for bracket, you solve bracket first. And then, if you have divide or multiply, you solve divide and multiply first. And then, if you have addition and subtraction, the last one, you solve addition and subtraction. But if only you have divide and multiply together, you solve from left to right. Okay, same goes to addition and subtraction. You solve from left to right. Okay, so let's say example given like this. Negative 5 plus negative 2 minus negative 6. So first, you change the sign first. 
this sign plus minus 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 okay plus minus different sign change into minus same sign change into plus okay so this one different sign this one is same sign okay so we solve from left to right because in this question we only have minus and plus so you solve from left to right no times no divide okay so negative 5 minus 2 negative negative same sign plus the number become negative 7 negative 7 then you copy plus 6 at the back okay from the question so negative 7 plus 6 different sign minus the number which one is bigger negative so negative 1 okay how to multiply or divide integers okay how to multiply or divide integers okay this is the tips for uh, multiply or divide same thing same as you learned just now if same sign positive positive or negative negative then the answer is positive same sign positive different sign negative okay same sign positive different sign negative okay so example given negative 4 times negative 3 times 4 so 4 no sign in front of 4 mean that the one is positive so you look at the sign negative positive negative positive different sign minus 3 times 4 3 times 4 equal to 12 so your answer should be negative 12 okay look at another one negative 6 times negative 4 look at the sign negative negative so it will become positive 6 times 4 equal to 24 okay so your answer is 24 negative 35 divide 5 so 5 no sign in front mean positive so different sign negative positive your answer will be negative 35 divided by 5 equal to 7 so your answer is negative 7 okay number 4 negative 26 divided by negative 2 so look at the sign negative negative is positive so 26 divided by 2 equal to 13 okay that's how we multiply or divide integers okay next combine operation so for combine operation we also use box mass rule okay box mass rule bracket divide multiply addition subtraction okay let's say example given like this the operation here we have is plus and times plus and time so follow the box mass we have to solve times first okay times first so negative 6 times positive 8 equal to this one equal to negative 48 okay so the rest the uh, negative 2 in the front in uh, in front of the number you just copy okay the negative 6 times plus 8 equal to negative 48 okay next plus minus change into minus negative 2 minus 48 so same sign you plus the number so you get negative 50 okay question number 2 negative 13 plus minus 22 divide negative 11 okay for in this question we have operation plus and divide so same as box mass rule we have to solve divide first negative 22 divide by negative 11 this one we you will get negative negative is positive 22 divide by 11 is 2 so positive 2 then you copy the rest negative 13 plus yeah, just now you calculate equal to plus 2 so plus plus we change into plus so negative 13 plus 2 so it's different sign minus the number negative bigger so negative 11 okay next another example okay negative 168 plus negative 3 over negative 11 plus negative 8 okay for this question you solve uh, you change the sign first Okay, plus minus, plus minus will become minus. Okay, both will become minus. Okay, now you solve at the top first. Negative 1, 6, 8, minus 3. Okay, you solve this one first. You calculate same sign plus the number. You will get 101, eh, 171. Negative 171. And then after that, the below one is negative 11 minus 8 equal to negative 19. Okay, and then after that, you solve negative 171 divided by negative 17, you will get the answer is negative 9. Okay, number 4, negative 81 divided 
negative 3 plus 9 times negative 7. Okay, for this case, we have 3 operation, divide plus time. Okay, so what must say, divide first or times first, from left to right. Okay, so we can solve this first, and then we can solve this first before we add these two number. So negative 81 divided by negative 3, negative, negative, positive, 27, 9 times negative 7, ne positive, negative is negative, 63. So we can write, write down like this, 27 minus 63, so your answer is negative 36. Okay, let's test our understanding. Which of the following is the correct step of calculation for the operation below? Okay, given the operation like this, so which one is the correct step? Okay, so you remember if you want to solve a combined operation which contains times, divide, multiply, and plus, subtract, so you follow the Bogmas rule. Okay, so Bogmas rule, bracket first. So 6 minus 12 equal to negative 6. Okay, the rest of the number you just copy down times 5 plus 3 and 2 over 5 divide 0 0.7 and next I want to change 3 to 3 and 2 over 5 into improper fraction is it negative uh, sorry 17 over 5 okay so you change into improper fraction and then 0 0.7 also I change into fraction 7 over 10 okay next I change divide into uh, into times and then over 10 the fraction after 7 over 10 will become 10 over 7 okay so it will become like this okay next we have times plus time so what must say times first times first and then after that you plus so negative 6 times 5 equal to negative 30 17 over 5 times 10 over 7 equal to 4 and 6 over 7 then you plus this two different sign minus so you will get negative 25 and 1 over 7 so we check which one is the same step as the answer given so if you look at this this is the answer so the answer should be B okay so you can do this in your exercise book the answer will be given later Okay, make sure you write down the step one by one. Okay, so that's all for today class. Thank you.